Hi YouTubers, Signal Hunter here. I'm sure a lot of you are familiar with this radio, the Sony ICF7600D. I bought this off of eBay. I got quite a deal on it. But after I got the radio, I was somewhat disappointed. It's been my experience here in Germany on eBay.de that when you're dealing with Germans, they have a very high degree of integrity. So when they're selling a used product at top Sustan, which means uh, excellent quality or excellent condition, that's exactly what you get. And so uh, after I got the radio, uh, it was with the antenna, it was dead. It was completely deaf. I couldn't get anything only on AM and FM. Now, I only paid 60 euros for this radio. And then I plugged in the external antenna and the thing came to life. Yeah, okay. Operated beautifully. But here's the problem. This broken wire here runs over to the antenna. And the pivot point was bound up and uh, by dirt and dust over the years, I guess. And they couldn't turn it, so they tried to force it, which snapped this plastic piece. And uh, it's not repairable in this way, unless I buy another radio or find this part. And I researched it, and this mechanism here, um, I couldn't find it anywhere. So I have to come up with an alternative to repair the radio. Of course, it'll no longer be in top zoo stand. But uh, it wasn't it when I first got it. And somebody said, well, you know, you can get your part of your money back because uh, they didn't list this as a defect. Well, I know that. What could I get back? 10 euros, 20 euros? The radio, uh, after I uh, plugged it into the external antenna, was actually very good. It was very, very sensitive. And uh, I DX'd a lot of uh, medium wave stations and also... Uh, a lot of shortwave stations. And I even picked up on medium wave uh, Saudi, Saudi Arabia, uh, Riyadh, I think it was, the broadcast. I didn't record it, but I nevertheless, I did receive it. And uh, so I'm happy with the radio, but I'm disappointed that the person that sold it to me uh, didn't list it as being defective. I feel a lot better getting it, knowing, you know, hey, I got to repair the antenna and getting the radio and believing that it was in 100% excellent condition. So anyway, actually looking through the radio, uh, has virtually no scratches on it, especially on the face. Everything looks good on it, and, uh, and it does work. So I'll just cut the loss and repair the antenna, which might be another problem in itself, but I've got an idea how to fix it. I'll make a video on that later. And uh, I hope to make some uh, a video on me DXing some faraway distance stations. To all my YouTube friends out there and subscribers, hello, have a nice weekend, Signal Hunter out.